Hey what's up guys and welcome to my new video. Today an updated version of the Nodus hack client for 1.7.2 got released and this is why I want to show you how to install Nodus once again. I just didn't want to update the link only because there were so many problems in the last video where people keep complaining that their Minecraft crashed, that they, um, I don't know, couldn't see the version or some other crazy stuff. And this is why I want to show you how to install it once again and hopefully successfully. And yes, so this is the beta version of Nodus, the previous version was the alpha version and there are still um, some bugs left but they are currently unfixable and also the skins are not working. But those bugs will be fixed in the next days or in the next week so just stay tuned. But this version should be a really improved version and so um, let's try to install this and then check out the features. Okay, so what you need is Minecraft 1.7.2 cracked or premium, it doesn't matter, it also works on the cracked version. I have here my premium Minecraft um, version. Okay, and the first thing you do is you go to the link in the description, so just click on it. Then you will be redirected to teamraiden.net. And I will also show you how to download it because people keep complaining that they couldn't find the download button. Okay, you just go to download here. Okay, then you will be redirected through AdFly to another site, so just be patient. Wait a few seconds until you can skip that. Okay, now skip. Okay, and here um, we have to find the fucking download button. So just click on this green arrow where it should say download, okay? Just click here. And now you should see, do you want to open or save notice.zip? And now you just go to save and then you save it anywhere on your desktop or on your computer. Okay, so this should be in my download folder. Yes. Okay, so here we have the notice folder and this is a zip file. That means we have to extract it and you can extract it with any program you want to. But if you never have done this before, or if you don't have any unzipping programs on your PC, you should install WinRAR. So the download link for WinRAR is also in the description. Just click on it and install it and then your zip file should look like this. And now you just do a right click on the zip file and then you go to extract here. Okay, now you should get two Nodus files. We have here one char and one JSON file and you should get a changelog file and a readme file, okay? Um, you can delete um, those two text files, you will not need them. And now we should have two Nodus files, okay? And now we have to insert them into our Minecraft folder. To do this on Windows, you just go to start, go here to run. And then you type percent app data percent and hit the enter button, okay? So percent app data percent, hit the enter button, and now we should be in the roaming folder. So if you have Windows 8 and you don't have this um, toolbar here, then you press the Windows key on your keyboard and the R button at the same time, okay? So here we go. And now you should also get this run menu and then just type percent app data percent, hit the enter button. And then it should open up the roaming folder. So if none of those methods um, works for you, then you just go to um, this path here. Um, it's just um, your main hard drive, slash users, slash your username, slash app data, slash roaming, okay? So now we should be in the roaming folder. Now we need to search our Minecraft folder. So here we have the .minecraft folder. So just look for it and open it up. Now we go to um, versions. And here you create a new folder, okay? And this folder has to be uh, exactly named like your um, Nodus file here. That means Nodus and with a capital N letter, okay? So let's go back to the folder, create a new one, and name it to rename it to Nodus with a capital N letter, okay? Nodus. Now you go into this folder and now just drag and drop both files in here, okay? Perfectly. So now we can start Minecraft and then we can run the hack. So here we go run. Okay, so now the new Minecraft launcher starts up and now we have to create a new profile. To create a new profile we go here to the left bottom corner and click at new profiles. Here we go. And now rename your profile name to anything you want to. So I will call it, I don't know, Notice 2. And um, now you go to this little arrow here where it should say use version. Just click on this and now check if you can see release Notice. If you can't see release notice, you just have to tick this little box here, which should say enable experimental development versions, snapshots. Okay, so click this box here. Now press the yes button and go to use version once again. And now you should see snapshot notice, okay? 
If you can see this, then just go to Save Profile and click Play. If you can't see Snapshot Nodos, you can do the following. So just untick this box here once again, close your Minecraft Launcher, now go back to your Minecraft folder, so um, re-enter percent app data percent. Now we go to dot Minecraft versions and Nodus, and in the Nodus folder you should have two files. You should have a char file and a JSON file. Okay. Now do a right click on the JSON file and go to edit, or you go to um, if you can't if you can't see edit, you just go to open with. If you go to open with. You can see recommended programs I have here Notepad. If you can't see Notepad, you should have it here under other programs. You can also open it up with WordPad or any other text editor. Okay, so let's open it up with Notepad. So here we go. And here in the first row somewhere, you should see Type, and then you should see Snapshot. Okay, now you just change that to Release. Make sure you type in everything with small letters, okay? So this is case sensitive. If you um, make a big R, it, it will not work, okay? So make a small R. Release. Okay, now you go to File and Save. Now you can close all the stuff here once again. And now um, reopen your Minecraft launcher. So here we go. Now you can edit your previously created profile or just create a new one. So I will create a new one. Notice 2. And make sure that this box here is unticked. And now we go to use version, and here should see release Notus. Okay, so now hit the save button and then go to play, and this should start up Notus. So let's try this. Okay, great. Minecraft is loading up. And here it is Notus for 1.7.2. Okay, so now let's go to a multiplayer server and check out if the hacks are working. So here we go, guys. Okay, guys, we're now here online on the multiplayer server, and to open up the hack client menu, we have to press the Y key on our keyboard. So this should open up here the hack client menu. And um, as you can see, we have here different tabs like building related hacks, movement related hacks, combat related hacks, world related hacks, and also some other stuff. And we also have here this new secret menu where you can do shit like ordering tacos or sink eater or I don't know, I'm um, checking out the partners. Then um, if you want to activate any of those hacks, you just have to click at them. A few hacks are still not working like, um, I don't know, tracers, as you can see tracers isn't working and also a few other hacks are not currently working very well. Um, what is working is also the ESP, which didn't work well in the, in the latest version and yeah. So um, we also have here a text radar and if you want to pin any of those screens here to your screen because if you close the menu with escape then everything is gone but you can pin um, some um, boxes here to your screen. If you want to see the coordinates just go to this little box here, tick it and then it's pinned to your screen. You can do this with all the items here. If you want to pin the text radar to your sc screen just do it. Here you can also switch from the text radar to the map radar and yeah. So um, I will not explain all the hack features here because um, this would take too many time. But I've uploaded a text file in the description which explains um, what each hack does. So if you don't know what um, a hack does then just check out the text file in the description and then you can read what each hack does. Okay, so this was the updated version of Nodos for 1.7.2. Um, no, I forgot one last thing. If you press the tab key now it doesn't crash your game anymore. But there are still a few more bugs, but I think they will be fixed next week or this week maybe. So just stay tuned for the next version. And um, I hope you enjoyed this video, but if you have any um, questions or if something isn't working for you, just post here a comment under this video and I will try to reply as soon as possible. So thanks for watching and as always, see you again in my next video. Bye!